Hi everyone, welcome to CTG. I'm back from OBR. Um, we mentioned this in a very short podcast last week that I would maybe visit Stake Your Bail on the Vive. So that's what I'm doing for this week's video. Again, it's just one, this one is just going to be a one off. What I'm going to do, there's three different modes. So I'll probably go through two rounds of each mode, just the first two. I've already played it, I've already reviewed it. You can find my review at fantasticgamer.com and as well as my content on CTG, you can also find me at the, everything at the bottom of the screen down there. All fantastic game, nice and easy. Anyway, we'll crack on and get on with this week's video. So you are. Janelle, you're starting to get on my nerves, human. So while this loads in, Unfortunately, I do have to face this way while playing because of the way the get room room scale works in this. And um, why it's loading, I'll explain it. You're a human. Unfortunately, we're out too. I've lost Buddy. He was not. There's Buddy there. He was you not. You take care of the me. bears, and I'll set my bros free. So Frank, I've got to help with panda teddies. Awesome, dude. You got Frank. a new weapon. From the normal teddies. Ah, bullets. Throw away your gun, pick up a new one for my belt! <laughs> this is what it is, I'm just gonna... Try throwing your gun at them! This game is this also available you, a master lock picker. on the PlayStation VR. I've played both versions. The higher version looks a little bit better. I pity the human who thinks he can stop me. The so shotgun can be used. It does get its proper use later. Shotgun on that dude's shield! That's gotta hurt! Him. Now, get rid of his shield. You reckon you can use two guns at once? Well, that was unexpected. Darn it! But if you think you can stop me and my friend from taking dude. over the world, you have what? another thing coming. See, that's Frank, the bad you my plans for world domination? It's not like you're getting out of here alive. <laughs> so as you'll see, I did better when I played it through for the reviewing. Um, I'm second on the global leaderboard with my score. Um, on there, so just look at my name. I wonder why that says Pam, that's my initials. <laughs> Let's continue. So I'll do, I'll jump to wave five on this one. Um. Junelle, you're starting to get on my nerves, human. Give me an idea. Difficult increases. But anyway, this basically this one is just a the wave based one. Uh, you gotta take them all out. If you survive. Actually, now I'm a bit further through. You get different quite a few different types of enemies now. These ones
never give up. When you give up your dream, you die. Is it better that time than I did the first time? There's a C second on the global leaderboard again. Um, that's one thing this game was launched with was the global leaderboard. Um, I have also reviewed it on PlayStation 2, because that's what I first played it on. Uh, and then Wild Duck sent me a code for the Vive one, um, and we shall be playing here. Things getting um, too hot to handle. One of the issues I took with the Vive one. The PlayStation VR one was a lack of global leaderboards. Um, Wardux had emailed me and say that that had been a lot of the feedback had been given about the PlayStation VR version. So what they've done, they've brought it into this version. Listen, dude, Frank's a total pyromaniac. You're gonna have to use your water gun to survive this place. But it has been added to the PlayStation VR version now with the latest update they've done. Cover me when you turn off the sprinklers. So with this one. Then I'm gonna do the highest this one as well. Use the water gun to put out the fires. Your water gun can't have enemies up. You gotta control the fires basically. Why? I'm a panther, not a firefighter. memories of this room I was born here. I think it's fitting that the room where I gained life is the room where you lose yours. <laughs> you idiot.
Tell me, what do teddy bears do when it rains? They get wet. Son of a... What I'm going to do now is, on the buy version, I didn't actually go, go through the whole thing because it was basically what I played on the PlayStation version. Are things getting too hot to handle? Being no difference. Um, so, I haven't done number four. Level four on this, so I'll jump onto that. Um, it's the same with the bombs, I only did the first three levels on the bombs on the next mode we'll look at. Um, so I'll do one and four on that one as well. Here we go. Go ahead. Make my day. Getting too old for this. I don't see. As well, I've chose... And I have chose to play this in the standard... Standard position. I used to be just your normal bear until my family was taken away. You think we are just toys that can be made and sold into slavery? Well, <laughs> no longer. I will find my family and we will have our vengeance. You know, it's the best I've done. Second on the global leaderboard. Anyway, but yeah, uh, as I was saying, you can play this from a seated position. Um, I've chosen to play standard with the Vive. Um, I sat on the PlayStation version. When I did my review of the Vive, I played that from a seated position. Um, dog, dick dog, you're running out of time. I thought I'd see if, if this one goes anywhere, basically. How is this one place stood up? Um, 
for this video. So here we go. On this one, you'll see. Oh, no. so my bros are trapped here. That wacko Frank is trying to blow them up with bombs. You need to use your freeze gun to stop the bombs. Try it out. No oh, oh. And I'm not going to do. I'm going to get enemies Dude, me. We need these defenses to stay strong. You do fine. The freeze, the freeze gun can be used to stop the enemies. You need any return. Charge up the freeze gun to get a more powerful shot. seen a ground teddy naked. But, again, start to bring my enemies in. Mode, stop the bombs, kill the enemies again as you're getting further through. The bombs start coming from either side, different locations, and my enemies start to come. As we'll see, because, I, like I said, I'm going to do two of each mode for the first of this video. So, what I'm going to do now is oops, tick tock, tick tock, you're running out of time. Is level four, which I'm not yet done on this level, on this, on this version of it. So we go level four. You see, there's two places the bombs are gonna come from.
You heat like a vegetarian. Not top of the global again. This guy seems to be top on all these ones. But anyway, that was it. That was a little bit of sneaky bears on the vibe. Now come on, go back to the factory. Like I said, this is available on PlayStation VR as well. Um, pretty much plays the same. I think it looks a little bit sharper on the vibe, but that's it. Everything else was pretty much the same, obviously, apart from the inclusion of the global leaderboard. But like I said, those are now available on PlayStation VR in the last update. So you get the best of it on PlayStation VR as well. Like I said, I've reviewed both versions. You can find both of them at fantasticgamer.com. And as I said at the beginning of the video, you can find me everywhere at the bottom of the screen, just under Fantastic Gamer, Twitch, Mixer, YouTube, and Twitter. Also, you can also find Crave Your Games on YouTube. Obviously, you watch this on YouTube if you found the channel. Also, pop over to cravethegame.probox.com for a fan and friendly community. And that's it. That's a bit of sneaky bears. And I'll see you, speak to you all later. Goodbye.